so we are about to head to our local oriental market and we wanted to bring you guys along so let's go I'm gonna give these a try. Okay, we're gonna start off with these items that we got from the Oriental Market. Uh, this one is the Triangle Gimbop. I think that's how you pronounce it. Tuna Mayo. I've been wanting these ever since I've been watching those 7-Eleven convenience stores on YouTube. The people who do the 24 hour eat at the 7-Eleven convenience store in Japan. But I found it. So I'm gonna give it a try. We found these dumplings at um, the Oriental Market as well. And I like that you can microwave them. I got this at uh, Publix. Um, if you guys don't know what Publix is, it is a grocery store here in the South. And then I got this. Don't know what it is, but it said it is pineapple flavored and I think it's a soda so I got it so we're going to give these a try I'm going to put these two items in the microwave and then I'll be back all right guys so I have everything that I need to heat up heated up so here are the beef dumplings it smells so good and the gimbap so I'm going to try this first because I really want to try it Okay. Ah. I don't know if I did this wrong. Did I do this wrong? Yeah. It told me to pull from the bottom. Uh oh. Uh oh. from this side. Hold on. Malfunction. All right. We're back. I was able to get it out. A latte told me how to do it. I just didn't pull the strip all the way. But this is how it looks inside with the tuna and the rice. So I'm just gonna, actually I'm gonna try it without uh, the spicy mayo first to get the flavors. This is really good. I have sesame seeds in there. This is good. The tuna actually tastes like it's smoked. Let me try it with a little bit of the spicy mayo.
You want to try this? Should I do this? Is real good. You like it? Mm-hmm. Watte likes it, guys. It's really good. They only had this type at the market though, so if I go again or whenever we do go again, um, I'll see if they have a different type. But this one is really good. Alright, I'm gonna try this Ocean Bomb Pineapple Flavor um, Soda. I have no clue who's on this can. Oh, never mind. It's a Sailor Moon. I guess it's Crystal? I don't know. I watched Sailor Moon when I was younger, but I wasn't really a big fan. Pretty good. You can taste the pineapple flavor. It's very light though. Okay, now we're gonna try the uh, beef dumplings. We're gonna try it without the spicy mayo. And then I'll try one with the spicy mayo. Pretty good. I like uh, dumplings, so you can't really go wrong with them. I mean, you can, but you can't at the same time. Okay. Let's try one with the spice mayo. No, I'd rather eat them without the spicy mayo. Wanna try one? Or two, or three, or four? The soy sauce? It's in the bag. Is it, it was in the, the Publix bag. Let's try them with, uh-oh. Some soy sauce. Very salty, but that's my fault because I put a lot of soy sauce on it. You want one with soy sauce? Yes. All right. Publix gives us these um, little soy sauce packages for free when we buy sushi, which my sushi is in the refrigerator because I'll be eating that probably tonight. All right, here's yours. Is that, you know, salty? I'll get better without it. Yeah, because it has like onions and I think bell peppers and mushrooms and stuff in it, so. The soy sauce makes it pretty salty, so. Probably finish them without the soy sauce. The, the soy sauce. And the spicy mayo. All right. I also got these. I forgot to say I was gonna try them, but we're gonna try them. Now, they're shrimp crackers, but I think they are um, like little puffs. Hopefully they don't. <laughs> Hopefully they're not um, too shrimpy.
You never smell your food before you eat it. Hmm. It's pretty good. Oh, this does not say, uh, oh, it does say spicy. It says spicy on the back. It doesn't say spicy on the front. Want to try it? They're, they're, they're good. Are they? They're not cheese. They're, they got spice. It says spicy chili paste. They got a kick to them. I don't like spicy stuff, y'all. A latte loves spicy stuff, so this is right up his alley. But they do have like a sugary spicy taste to them. That's what they look like. A good crunch. Yeah, a latte really likes them. But that's all really we got to try. A latte got a lot of drinks, but he's not gonna eat them. I mean, drink them right now. So hopefully we can go to another market that we've been looking forward to going to. This one was just a small little market um, in our area. So uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Haha, <laughs> just kidding guys. We're not done. I forgot all about these. Now, I have had... Uh, these before not this type with the fruit flavored bean paste but i've had mochi before um i i didn't like it but i want to give these a try to see if um i like these better so here we go all right so from the package, it says there's mango, peach, and pineapple. What you guys see? Mm -hmm. um, there's four different colors, so I, I don't know which one is which, but this one might be peach. This one is orange, but it kind of looks brown. Oh, well, maybe these, these two are orange. They look the same. And this one is probably pineapple. Going based off the colors. All right, so let's give, which one did I say this was? The peach one. They're cold, by the way. You have to keep them in the refrigerator. Um, let's give the peach one a try. A latte, are you gonna try it? I think it's the texture I don't like. I don't, I don't, it's like a gummy texture, but it was like a gritty texture. The flavor is good. I don't, I don't think I too much care for the texture, but you like the tapioca balls and boba. I don't. So you might like it. I'm going to take a little bite. Sorry to the people who don't like people talking when they eat. Sorry. No, no. I got the feeling. I got more feeling in this bite than I did the first bite. So maybe. <laughs> What's wrong? Maybe that's part of what it was. But I like the feeling in it. That one is peach. It tastes good to me. It tastes this one tastes better to me than I don't know you can have it because there's another one than the uh, traditional one these are just flavored you like it? 
says he doesn't know guys if, if if you can't hear him he doesn't want to quite be on the camera yet so you're going to hear him in the background a little bit this one is the mango one they're pretty sweet that one was pretty sweet but it's really cold in the middle it wouldn't be something that we eat all the time though no i think it is just like a sweet treat they have i don't think they eat them all the time this is mango mango tastes better to me it's like peach rings but mango tastes better Oh no, the, the, the inside consistency kind of messes with me. The texture? Yeah. <laughs> it's not nasty. It's good. It's I not. Think it's He's... like dry paste and jelly like mixed. That's the outside. The outside, I think this is like um, cornstarch or whatever. <laughs> you don't like it? The peach, I mean, the mango one is better. You don't like it? No, it's, 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 it's just messing with you. I I'm over the texture right now because they're actually tasting good. They actually taste good. I'm over the texture at this point. I I already know what to expect. So this one is the the pineapple one that we're gonna try. And if you see me right here playing with it, it's because you can easily rip them apart. So here we go. Pineapple. Mm -hmm. Not liking the pineapple so far. The pineapple is good, but it's not nasty. It's just not my cup of tea. Not my I cup do of tea. Know the mango one is the best one out of all three flavors. I think this is the same. They look like the same color. So I'm not gonna even attempt to try that one. I'm just gonna continue to eat this mango one. A latte is really having a hard time behind this camera. <laughs> all right, guys, that was it. That was a good little, uh, haul from the oriental market that we live near uh so we will see you guys in the next video bye sasha wanted to be on camera guys say hi say hi you don't want to talk today you don't want to talk to the people oh okay all right say bye